Well, it's been a busy weekend in the tropics, but thankfully nothing near us. Your local weather expert, Alexandra Cranford, is here. And Alexandra, I heard that there's a wave off of Africa that could develop soon. What yeah. is the latest on that? Yeah, it's not developed yet, Winnie, but it okay. probably will maybe in the next week or so. So the chance for development going up a bit. In fact, it's 90% now within the next week. So this will likely be our next depression or maybe even a tropical storm not too long from now. If it does develop, it looks like it would get the name Lee. L-E-E. L -E -E. There's another spot that might develop as well, but you can see clearly this one looking like it will probably head off a little farther to the north and not even over the ocean yet. And then here are these two. These are the two tropical storms that we have. Actually, Katia just now getting out of tropical storm range. These two obviously not going to be much of a concern, but I know you might have your eye on this one. Actually, the big global models, of course, when you go really far out, it's not really worthwhile. They tend to get less accurate. However, uh, at this point, that's about all that you can really say because it's so far out. This is really far out in the Atlantic, so we have no threats to our area for at least the next week plus and maybe longer. Here is what we're thinking, though. The big global models do show at the end of their range, which we're getting toward uh, as it approaches the Caribbean Sea. They do have it going off to the north. For example, let me show you really quickly. The European model shows those two waves moving out over the ocean. You can see them and that one that may become Lee, you can see starts to move off to the north following the upper pattern there by a long time from now, over a week from now. So we'll be tracking it, but no threat here. Of course, we are coming up on the peak of the season now that we're into September. The peak day is September 10th. That means we are one week away from the average peak day of hurricane season, and then eventually we will be on the downslope as far as tropical activity goes. Now we're not out of the woods. Of course, we're going to watch everything super closely in this time of year. We watch extremely closely, even extra closely. So we'll be doing that for you. But at this point, again, no threats from the tropics for us. Instead, we've gotten to enjoy some rain this Labor Day weekend, and we do have it in the forecast tomorrow, too. I'll have more on that coming up in a few minutes.